Hi, this is Fernando from Seriously Smart Technologies. I wanted to make a brief video about how to change or mute the sounds in your biofeedback software. This became possible within Windows Vista, Windows 7, that you could easily change your volume or mute the volume in the software, uh, but still leaving the other sounds, other, uh, you know, whether you have music uh, running on your computer from uh, the Windows Media Player or from YouTube. So let me just show you. You come down here to the bottom corner and you'll see the little speaker icon. Left click on that once. Your volume control will now open up. Go ahead and click Mixer. And let me move this over. So you can see all the programs that I'm currently running that are wanting that I can control the volume on. So this is where you can come in here and mute or yeah, mute, like your biofeedback sounds, you'll see I've got my Indigo software running. Sometimes there's a bar down here on the bottom that lets you scroll over to the right, and that's if you have even more programs open, like, say, Body Viewer, uh, or other, even different panels within the software will let you mute the music. Now, with in regards to Disease Dictionary, you want to make sure to mute Disease Dictionary within the Disease Dictionary panel, and not here. Uh, if you try to... Once Disease Dictionary goes, and if you hear those sounds going, it sounds like like classical music. And if you try clicking on your volume control icon down here, it can actually lock up your computer uh, for a few minutes. So don't do that. Try just checking the box within the Disease Dictionary program to mute the music. But all the other pro, uh, biofeedback panels, you can come in here and do that. And that's it. That's how easy it is to control the volume on your computer if you're using Windows Vista, Windows 7, or newer, Windows 8, Windows 10. Well, this is Fernando from Seriously Smart Technologies. Thanks, and take care.